Now that we've set up our form, we want to tailor the experience by adding logic. This helps us make sure that people get to see the right questions and will ultimately help us prioritize our leads. We'll add logic to our form by going to the Logic tab. Since we want to set different rules for different questions, we'll use branching and calculations. First, we'll add logic to question one. So if they need help with their website, we want to see what we're working with. So we'll send them to question two, which asks them to drop a link to their website. But we also want to see their website if they need help with SEO, their brand, or if they're not sure of what they want. So we'll add an or condition to each of these answers too. Then we'll add another rule that says if they're looking for help with social media, we'll send them to question three, which asks for their social media handles. But don't forget, they can choose more than one option in question one. So we'll account for that by adding logic in question two. First, we'll say that if they need help with social media in question one, we'll send them to question three, asking about their social media handles. This covers anyone who chose more than one option in question one, where social media was one of them. Then we'll add another rule and say that if the answer to question one is not social media, then they'll jump to question four, asking about their budget. So this ensures that anyone who didn't answer social media will skip the question asking about their social media handles. Now, the only thing left is to add logic to the last question. Here we'll base the logic off of question four, which asks how much budget they have. This is an opinion scale question where zero is less than $2,000 in budget and 10 is over $10,000 in budget. So we'll say if they answer six or more, we'll send them to ending A, which gives them a link to schedule a call with us. In all other cases, which would be five or below, we'll send them to ending B, which says we'll get in touch within 48 hours. Click save, and we're all done. You should preview the form here to make sure you've added all of the logic correctly. Now, to add some flair and get it out there, 